ladies and gentlemen, uh, welcome to the second to last stop on my world record breaking attempt to perform the most Shakespeare plays ever performed solo on a single day in Brooklyn. We have 29 plays down. I have two more planned. Uh, unfortunately, we're running a little behind schedule. I was planning on doing a uh, full version of Romeo and Juliet here. I was going to construct a balcony. It was going to be amazing. Unfortunately, we are running out of time, so this is going to be very quick. I need everybody in the room who's here for the Shakespeare per performance to come and gather around the pool table. Everybody, grab your beers, grab your books. What, you don't have a book yet? Is there anybody here? who has not yet purchased their copy of My Name is Will, a novel of sex, drugs, and Shakespeare. <laughs> oh, you all have! <laughs> okay, good. Well, then I don't have to harass any of you. Everybody gather around. Come on, in closer. Snuggle up. I want people right up next to the bar here. Right up next to the pool table. Come on, everybody. Come on, make friends. Get, get, get right up here. Don't worry. She's, she's just with the New York Times. Don't worry about it. Come on. Everybody gather in close. Uh, what this is, is a bar trip. For the first time ever, Romeo and Juliet performed by one man with just two hands. My lovely assistant here has brought a good guest, please, thank you, an applause for my lovely costume and prop assistant. She has brought tattoos, temporary tattoos, uh, to represent the families of Montague and Capulet, which she will now be applying to my hands. take about 30 seconds. <laughs> uh, while while they're setting, um, I will perform for you the prologue to Romeo and Juliet, uh, as if performed by Bullwinkle J. Moose. <laughs> <laughs> Two households, both alike in dignity, in fair Verona, where we lay our scene, from ancient grudge break to new mutiny, where civil blood makes civil hands unclean. From forth the fatal loins of these two foes, a pair of star-crossed lovers take their life, whose misadventured piteous or throws do, with their death, bury their parents' strife. Roger <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the families of Capulet and Montague. <laughs> Romeo and Juliet, do not blink. <laughs> I hate you, I hate you, I love you, I love you. I hate you, I kill you, I'm dead. He's dead, I'm sad, I'm asleep. She's dead, I'm sad, I am dead. He's dead, I'm sad, I am dead. You are sad. <laughs> the greatest play ever written in the history of the English language, Hamlet, the Tragedy of the Prince of Denmark, at Freebird Books. I'll see you there. <laughs> <laughs>